Alex and Tango Station. I have a very interesting beer here. Mm. It's Faro from Girardin Brewery. Uh, 1882. Uh, really, I can't tell you much from the label. It's very simplistic. There's just, you know, uh, like calories over there. Um, ingredients here, but not in English, so um, hard to read. But what I'm guessing is water, malted barley, wheat, hop, carlo, E150. So I think it's just uh, for coloring and sacralose, so it's sweetener. Alcohol 5% ABV, here, so small print, everything is really small print, uh, it's hard to say anything. Uh, so it's a Belgian beer. And it's Faro, so what's, what's Faro? Faro? It is a port in Portugal. No, it is, uh, but Faro is um, sweetened lambic. And usually, Faro was you know, worst of the worst <laughs> lambic. So, poor lambic uh, sweetened with brown sugar, or candied sugar. And it was uh, done on the spot, you know, when serving. So beer had no chance to ferment the sugar, right? Um, so there was no bottled versions of this because it, they could explode. Uh, the other thing is that it could be um, blended lambic, blended young poor lambic. Usually it was like a you know, third sort, weak. Uh, and it was blended with uh, another uh, lambic or another beer. Really, it, it doesn't matter. It was it was a blend uh, with sugar, so easy easy drinking. You know, a little bit sweetened beer, uh, not very good, but popular because it was cheap. Um, right. So let's have a try what it is. Uh, well, they make effort to be cheap, you know, with sweeteners and, you know, E150 <laughs> added. Well, it has a cork. Small half uh, champagne bottle, 375 uh, milliliters. So let's open it and have a try. Uh, what's in, uh, interesting about the style, it is that uh, it was uh, one of the styles in the Witcher game. Sintra Faro. So um, it was like liked by um, Siemens from Sintra. And by the fans is uh, like regarded as you know Citra and uh, England that like, connotated. It's a Belgian beer. So, I don't know. Well, it's not so far from England, don't you think? Right, let's open it. Ooh. Uh, it looks like it's nicely carbonated. Amber color, clear. Uh, head, a little bit off color. Small and medium bubbles. It looks nice. Aroma, a little bit easty. Soury. Quite, 
well isn't fruity. Okay, let's have a try. Hmm, interesting. It has this sour character. So bitterness. But usually in lambics, I and uh, Belgian use the old uh, hops just to add a little bit of bitterness, nothing else. Mm. So it is a, like a herbal bitterness. A um, little bit of sourness. It's not really sweet, but quite quite mild. Mm. Some sweetness in it, of course, but now uh, yeah, it's quite drowned. Uh, body, I would say full. Quite nice carbonation. It reminds me something. What it is? It has like a um, cider type aroma, mm, a little bit easty, um, this kind of fruitiness, you know what, it tastes a little bit like a mix of cider and beer, with really nice bitterness, um, a little bit of caramel, but tiny little bit, yeah, it's a cider. Cider type aroma. Yeah, and taste. Yeah, caramel up to um, tones there as well. Some melandoidic accents in, in bitterness. Well, it's not so bad. Uh, a little bit of farmhouse um, notes there, but very tiny. Well, interesting. Uh, because it's a little bit different. Mm. But exciting? Maybe not. But definitely easy drinking. Uh, quite highly carbonated. Some wine notes as well there. Mm. Well, good enough, I think. Um, you can drink this beer, you know, reading a book uh, about Geralt of Rivia adventures or watching film. Upcoming Netflix series, maybe Polish series, oh, why not? Or I think it would be even better just playing games. There are three games. Uh, with Witcher, then you have Wind, uh, so it's like a, a card game, and in development, I think, it's a RPG game in the world of uh, mm, the Witcher. Uh, but the main character is it's not the Witcher. Witcher probably will appear somewhere in the end of the game but just a guess so i hope you enjoyed this video as much i enjoyed this bit it's quite nice so please like it please subscribe my channel and when you've done it already hit the bell button to remind you about every new video on the channel so you'll be up to date cheers